Well, one person is dead after an attempted robbery outside the Hollywood Hills of the CE Hollywood Hills home of the CEO of a fashion retailer. And that person died after police pulled over the suspects in West Hollywood early this morning. That's where KKL 9's Rachel Kim is live on Doheny Drive in Santa Monica Boulevard with the investigation. Rachel. Juan and Susie, the suspect's getaway car was stopped right behind us here at this intersection after the robbery and shootout at that Hollywood Hills home just after 2 a.m. Right now, the question is, was the fashion company CEO the target? Police rushed to the 1400 block of Blue Jay Lane in the Hollywood Hills after an early morning robbery that left one person dead. Property records show the house belongs to Richard Sagian, the CEO of the company Fashion Nova. His neighbor heard several shots. Oh, yeah, boom, 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 boom. I mean, there's a lot of gunshot going on. A source close to Sagian tells us he was with two friends earlier last night and they came back to his home. Sagian was inside when his friends were robbed outside by two suspects who got out of an Audi with handguns and wearing ski masks. The LAPD says the suspects then forced the victims onto the ground and took their watches and jewelry. They put a gun on their head. Uh, we watched the money and the. And the and your watches. During the robbery, an armed security guard at Sagian's home exchanged gunfire with the armed suspects. Fougere tells us the security guard is a retired law enforcement officer. He got out of the car, he, he, he intervened, he shot the bad guys, he got shot in the stomach, he's in critical condition. At that point, the suspects got back in the Audi where a getaway driver was waiting. But a short time later, police spotted the car near the intersection of Doheny Avenue and Santa Monica Boulevard. At that time, they did a traffic stop. The three men were in the car. They requested the fire department because two of those men were suffering from gunshot wounds. Police say one of the robbery suspects had been shot in the abdomen and died where the car was stopped. The second suspect was shot in the ankle and was taken to the hospital. The third suspect, the driver, was taken into custody. Investigators also recovered a handgun from the Audi. The two robbery victims were also injured, but police say they're stable. Now, detectives are looking to find out if this was a crime of opportunity or if Sagian and his friends were targeted. Crime is up. Everybody's getting burglarized, but now we're getting shot at. LAPD's robbery homicide detectives are investigating and looking into whether this incident is related to other robberies in the Hollywood area. Anyone with information is asked to give them a call. A representative for Mr. Sagan tells us he has no statement or comment at this time. Reporting live in West Hollywood, Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News. Rachel, thank you.